Hello there vloggy vlogsters. It's Thursday. It's another week. It's still the pandemic. Um, my Glossier order has just arrived, which is very exciting. Got some uh, backups of my Too Faced cloud paints. I basically wear one of these every day or have done it over the summer. I did last summer as well. Um, mine are nearly finished, which will show you how much I've worn them because anyone who uses cloud paint knows how long it lasts. Uh, I also got two new ones in like slightly darker shades, which I thought might be more fun for autumn, winter. Uh, boy brow, mine's on its last legs. Uh, I have not found anything I like better than boy brow in brown for my brows. And a future dew, which I've been wearing every day, I think, since I got it. I absolutely love it. Um, my skin was feeling a bit dry, a bit parched, a bit bleh. Um, and this just, yeah, it's made it feel bouncy and lovely. So big fan of that, wear it on under makeup. That noise was this guy. <laughs> wear it under makeup or like just on its own on no makeup days. It's lovely. vlogsters um it's sunday did a vlog at all yesterday may have briefly um shown you breakfast um but we had quite a busy day but like really nice day yesterday one of those days where i felt like tired at the end of it but because of achieving things and also socializing um yeah and nice food and things um yeah we just went to pup we got up had breakfast went to pup school where he did really well um and then uh went and dropped him off at my parents house and then uh, he raced around there for a couple of hours whilst we went to Ikea to pick up some stuff, which you'll see in a mo. Then we came back here, dropped all the Ikea stuff off, because we couldn't fit Wesley and the Ikea stuff in the car. Went back to my parents, had a really nice Thai takeaway, um, then came back and collapsed in snoozes because everyone was tired out. This morning, Dan has gone off to meet his dad to take Wesley for a walk. Um, whilst he does that, oh, one of the other things I did yesterday was soak all the fruit for the Christmas cake this year and mince meat because I think it's stir up Sunday like next like the Sunday after next but we're gonna be away because we're heading down for our replacement week away with um Jess and Babe and Linda and Chris and Bibbies um that we were meant to go on but instead we languished here in a week of um local lockdown staycation. Um <laughs> So we've got that. Um so we're away and then um we're going down to London the weekend after that. So it will be way too late to make the Christmas cake then, so I'm going to make it like a week and a bit early or two weeks early. That's my mission this morning, um, while Stan's out. And then when he gets back, he was meant to go into archery this afternoon, but it's actually peeing it down outside. So he will help me do the IKEA flat pack that I was going to do myself. Christmas cake. Here's all my lovely fruit. Ooh, that's the mincemeat. Oh my God, this smells amazing. And the fruit for the cake. Edited. Uh, Dan has messaged me so he's on his way home from his walk. The weather has improved, so I don't know whether he will actually be going to archery or not. Um, but here is what we're trying to achieve IKEA wise this afternoon. I say we, could be I, could be we. We'll see whether he goes. Oh, and of course, can't forget some top sandwich action. Big fans of top sandwich action at the weekend. Uh, something like Perry and Blue Cheesy, I think, today. is taking a while it is a quite large construction um we are getting there 
Ooh, all the carcasses built and in place. It's really hard at angle to get, actually. You can kind of see it there. Um, but it, we do have this <laughs> to deal with. Fortunately, I planned ahead and dinner is an easy one. It's just a Nigella one pot pasta thing. So Dan has ably done that whilst I've been flat packing away and uh, that'll be done in half an hour or so. I'm going to attempt, oh, because the bag's under my eyes. <laughs> I'm now going to attempt some, uh, some doors and some shelves. So hopefully we can move some of the stuff into the cupboards tonight. Um, I am wearing a new sweatshirt today, which I'm very excited about. It says take more naps. I've taken zero naps this weekend, which is just horrifying, to be honest. It's not the life I want to lead, but it'll be worth it if this sorts out our understairs horrendousness that's been there since we moved in. <laughs> and we're stopping here because we have very much run out of steam. It's so nearly there, but it's bedtime.